So you want to learn how to build rapport in MLM without being annoying and losing your friends and family. Hi, want to be friends? Okay. So how's your family? My family? What do you do for work? Oh, I'm a... What do you like to do for fun? Well, I like to... Buy my stuff. There's like two spots left. Ground floor opportunity. It doesn't have to be like this. In fact, when you do, you're only pushing away the business-minded people, you know, the ones that you want. And so stay tuned. I'm gonna give you guys four different ways that you can build rapport without being annoying and losing your friends and family. Okay, so if it's your first time meeting me, my name is Trey Bear. I put out new videos each week to teach network marketers just like you how to generate leads and get more sales in their business without the 24 seven grind and the fake it till you make it BS. And hey, if you like what you see inside this video, hit the thumbs up, comment below, and consider subscribing and clicking that little bell to be notified and alerted every single time a new video gets uploaded. And before we get into the meat and potatoes of this video, don't you forget to go grab my free download where you can swipe and copy 12 ridiculously effective social media posts that will get prospects reaching out to you and begging you for more information. You can find the link to that in the description section below this video. All right, so when it comes to building rapport in MLM as a network marketer, most people think that the only way to build rapport and get people to know, like, and trust you is through Messenger. And that's simply not true. What is true and most important is yes, that you get people to know, like, and trust you if you want to sell more of your products and get more people to join your download. But let's think about this. Have you ever attended a concert with your most favorite band or musician or you bought their music because the band messaged you one-on-one? -on -one? No. Have you ever bought Nikes or Beats headphones because Michael Jordan or Dr. Dre himself reached out to you personally and started asking you about your family and what you do for fun and where you work? No. So how can you build rapport with prospects without having a conversation and feeling like you're just nagging and being that annoying network marketer? Number one, one showing behind the curtains. One of the fastest ways of building rapport without being annoying, without being a messenger, is through using stories. Listen, stories are real time. There's no BS. They can be pictures or video that are basically a highlight reel of your day or what's happening and what you're up to. You can use stories to notify your following every time you upload a YouTube video or a new blog or a podcast. And even better, you can speak directly to your audience on whatever topic you want just by whipping out your phone and hitting record. Now you might be thinking, Trey, my life is really not that interesting. Well, that's not the point. The point is your following can see more of behind the curtains with you. Have you ever seen someone online with the most perfect edited photos? They're all HD and their life looks amazing. Well, do you really trust that that's what their life looks like? Do you really trust that person? Not entirely. But what if they had this opportunity that could allow you to get out of debt and make a million dollars? Would you join them? Would you buy it? Probably not because you don't exactly trust them yet but stories allow you to instantly connect with your audience in a real and raw transparent way and you can do this without being tied down to and wasting your time inside messenger with sending one-on-one -on -one messages so whip out your phone and start sharing your life a little bit more throughout the day using stories number two content content Content. One of my favorite ways of building rapport with people without spending my time messaging people one-on-one -on -one is building out content just like this. Even though it's incredibly scary to just put yourself out there, that's what people are desperately seeking. For example, I started doing Facebook Live when it first came out. I was ridiculously nervous. I didn't have any idea what to talk about. But one thing I knew is that I wanted to teach people. And since I loved learning these network marketing tips and tricks and secrets to get Getting success faster, I thought, why not teach everything that I'm learning to you? And I remember when I first started Facebook Live, I only had like three live viewers, but my focus wasn't on views. My focus is on sharing secrets with those who are looking for the answers. So I kept showing up and my like page, my fan page on Facebook, which is called That Effing Guy, went from zero likes to almost 30,000 followers as I'm shooting this video right now. And so you can take that same exact concept, Facebook Live, YouTube videos, a podcast, with the same goal of publishing content that adds value, and more importantly, it indirectly builds rapport with people who are just like you and I. Because here's the truth, 
People are looking for a mentor, someone that they actually like and can trust, and someone who doesn't mind sharing their answers. They might not like me, but they might like you. But if you're too scared to publish content and just put yourself out there, it's unquestionable that they will never find you. Number three, starting your own community. Guys, you want an easy way to build rapport, build your authority, and spread your message easily and effortlessly. Create your own Facebook group. By using a Facebook group, this is where you can build out your culture and find like-minded individuals just like yourself. For example, I run a Facebook group called the No BS Blueprint to Success Inside Network Marketing. Inside this group, this is where I can ask members more closely what they're looking for help on. What questions do they have? We do Facebook Lives inside the group. There's simple PDF trainings inside there. And anyone who's looking to make an extra income inside network marketing can be inside that group, get to know us a little bit more, know, like, and trust, and see what it is that we can offer to help them. And guess what? The cool part of being an admin of your group, you're automatically the leader. <laughs> You don't need any PhD credentials. You don't need to have a superstar model status. And you instantly have the authority because when people get inside your group, they're gonna be looking for the expectations and what the next steps are. And there you are as the authority figure, giving them value and not selling them on anything. Now my last and most favorite way to build rapport inside MLM without being annoying and without losing your friends and family members is number four, building the attractive character. First off, comment below if you've ever watched the movie Rudy. Just say Rudy in the comments section below. This is one of my favorite movies because it's all about this guy who used to work in a factory with his family and he wanted to play football for Notre Dame but he didn't have the grades and he was tiny compared to everyone else on the football field. He'd try out and he wouldn't make the team. He'd come back, poured sweat, blood and tears and he still didn't make the team. And then in part of the movie he loses one of his closest friends to a tragic accident inside that factory and his family, his friends, and even the football players on the field didn't believe that he'd actually ever make the team. But then his last year, he actually made the team and he even went on to make a game changing tackle in one of the games. I'm ready for this my whole life. Now it wasn't the tackle that made people love Rudy and make this movie so amazing. The reason that people love Rudy is because he's relatable. He has flaws but he still doesn't give up. And because he gives us hope that we can follow our dreams and we can make it as well. He shows us that it's gonna to be tough, but it's absolutely gonna be worth it. That's how you build an attractive character and you can sell MLM without being annoying to your friends and family. And being stuck inside Messenger, trying to build rapport and asking people about their family, their occupation, and what they like to do for fun before you actually pitch them on your product or opportunity. <laughs> Now those who are looking to be perfect on social media will never understand this and will never get any further ahead inside the network marketing business because people on social media are not looking for perfect. They're looking for people who are just like them that they can connect to that have flaws and are going to say, hey, don't worry, I got you. I went through that as well. I'll take you by the hand and we can go on this path to success together. And look, I get that it's really hard to be vulnerable and air your garbage out on social media. So check out this video that I made right here. This video will help you with this strategy and you can implement this as quickly as today. Go check out this video and you can see exactly how to do this. And so guys, these are my four tips of how you can build rapport inside MLM without being annoying and without losing your friends and family family and spending all your free time building rapport one-on-one -on -one via Messenger. And if you'd like help with what to post on social media to get prospects reaching out to you and asking you for information, go download this free download I have for you today called 12 Ridiculously Effective Social Media Posts that'll get prospect reaching out to you and begging you for information. Again, the description section below, you can find the link to get that today. And if you like this video, please give me the thumbs up and consider subscribing to this channel. And so the question of the day is, what are some strategies that you use inside network marketing to generate more leads and get more sales in your business without being that typical annoying network marketer? Comment below this video with your answers and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.